No, no, no. Stop guessing answers this instant. But I was doing it right. I think you're not paying attention at all. Yes, I am. You're just being annoying so think straight, lady. That's it, young lady. You are coming with me out in the hallway for a big talk. Vicky, you do not ever call me annoying. Stop covering your ears and making frightening faces. That's very disrespectful against our school. Now stop it. And quit making that angry face at me. How about you lower your voice? It's hurting my ears. You have no right to tell an adult what to do. Besides, I don't care if I'm hurting your ears, but I will scold you when you do not follow directions. You know what? I'm done with you scolding me for ridiculous reasons. And it's making my ears drip blood. I am going to end your voice forever. I will cut out your voice box, psychotic jerk. Fine, you psychopath. Vicky, I just saw you on cameras cutting out Mrs. Terry's voice box. You know that's illegal. Why on earth would you do such a violent thing? Because when Mrs. Terry scolded me for no reason, she won't let me cover my ears, and it's hurting my ears. Vicky, do you have any idea what you did? Mrs. Terry can no longer talk for the rest of her life because you cut out her voice box. You're permanently expelled from school. Vicky, we can't believe you got expelled from school for cutting out your teacher's voice box. Doing something like that may get you arrested. You are grounded forever. Now go to your room. I hate you, Dad.